I made it to the Orlando airport and it is so crowded. I don't think I've ever seen the airport here this busy. It is just past 11. I just made it to the resort. I'm saying we're, I was just saying were when I came with my mom, but um, I'm staying at the tower and um, my room is already ready. So my plans for today is I need to go drop myself off in my room. Then I need to go over to the convention center and get my bib and um, hopefully get this jersey that I wanted, but they sell out so fast. So I don't know if I'll be able to get one. Um, and then I'm going to Disney Springs. I feel like something used to be here. Like a little coffee, something, and it's gone. That feels very empty. Anyways, I don't know. Anyways, I'm gonna give you guys a little room tour. This is the bathroom. A little closed door for, you know, poopy time, but uh, by myself anyway, so. We got this, oh, yeah, a little closet. And then just basically a basic room. This is my view of the beautiful parking lot. <laughs> I can see the, oh look, I can see the Epcot all over there though. Right there. Oh, they moved the coffee thing right here. I knew I used to be over there, you guys, I'm telling you. Anyways, I got things to do, so I gotta get going. All right, I got a teeny bite to eat upstairs and now I am headed to the expo uh, to get my bibs and hopefully get something cool, some new merchandise. I don't know, it might all be sold out because normally the early bird with these events get the worms, so we'll see. Also, the weather is really nice for Florida. It's like mid 70s. It's so nice. Oh, they're washing the windows. I made it to the wild world of sports to uh, pick up my bib and I had to sign into a virtual queue to go into the merchandise shop, which is in 115 minutes. So it's a long wait. So I'm just gonna take my sweet time going to get my bib and get my race shirts and just enjoy the 70 degree weather. First is race bib pickup. This is the bib pickup room. Look at that. That's so cute. I gotta check into the 5k first and then the challenge. So I picked up my bib for the 5K and I'm in group A, yay! And for the two course challenge, I only have one bib and I'm in group C, which totally makes sense. And that's it. And it's got pigment on it, it's cute. They have these different photo ops and y'all better believe that when I showed you and walked in, I'm gonna go, there's a long line for it, but I got time. So I'm gonna go stand in line for that photo op. I made it to the unofficial Run Disney Expo. This is without all the official Disney merchandise. Oh, I see Hoka shoes. But anyways, I have to pick up my shirt here. Right here on this wall, they have all the medals displayed for this race and upcoming races. I'm gonna show you guys all the medal races I'm gonna be running for until April. These are for the Wine and Dine weekend. This is the challenge medal. And then, ah, I love yeah. this one. Um, this is a half marathon. This one's the 10K. Oh, it's Vince. Oh, cool. And then Alice in Wonderland. These are for the January races. 5K, which I'm doing. 10K, which I'm doing. The half marathon, which I'm doing. The full marathon. The challenge and the other challenge. I'm doing all of these. This one, I guess, lights up somehow. I don't know how. And these are the, oh wait, they don't have the ones in April. Never mind. but these are the princess weekend. I'm not doing the aerial. I couldn't get the 5K, but I did get the 10K. So we'll be here for this one. I did get the half marathon one. Which I'm so excited for this one. It's Tiana. And then I signed up for the challenge. So I'm getting this one as well. So that's exciting. Okay. I got all four of my shirts. I've been waiting about uh, almost an hour now since I got my shirts, but I haven't showed you guys yet, but it's windy out here. Anyways, I got about 20 minutes left and then I can go in and see if they still have that jersey. I want size large because Disney stuff seems to shrink. So I want to get a large so it'll shrink down to fit me. I hope they have it. It's really the only thing that I want. My group to get to the expo hall has finally been called. <laughs> Yay, shopping. <laughs> Better grab a cart, you never know. That's the jersey I want right there. Okay, let's just see if I can find a large. They got a ton, okay? This is good, this is good. A large right here. Yay! 
see here's the back of it oh and i love yellow yay okay hooray success it's super wrinkly but this is what this is what i wanted the most yay okay i'm gonna go see what else they got but this is what i wanted look they also have headbands wine and dine 2023 those are so cute Here's the figment uh, challenge stuff. So I don't know if they'll have anything cool, but um, if I can find something cool figment, I might run away with it. Oh, look at these. They got wine and dine bags. Oh, those are cool. I like that. Okay, so I'm just gonna leave with the one shirt, which is what I really wanted. They had it, I'm more than happy. I didn't really have anything figment that I wanted. and. The bag I don't really need, so I'm getting this one thing, but I'm that's what I wanted the most, that's what I'm happy with. Also, look at this, they have these miles set up, so that's for the challenge ones. You can come in there and take your pictures next to whatever miles you're going to be running. Oh, that's fun. I'm walking through the, the Port Orleans Resort, and I've never been here before. I'm going to get um, a, uh, a boat to go over to Disney Springs, and it looks like they have these little bitty streets, these like look all fashion street it's so cute i've never been here before look it's like a little mini street okay so even though this is a resort i love when i find places at disney world ignore the honking bus that's just kind of like there's not very many people it's quiet it's peaceful i mean besides the honking bus I mean, boat behind me i just want to share with you guys that there are hidden spots around disney world but there's like nobody and it's great Okay, that was a fun little boat ride, but I am, I made it to Disney Springs and I'm going to World of Disney first because rumor is they've already put out some of the Christmas merchandise like today and I gotta go see it. Look who I ran into! Hi. Just randomly here. There's what the heck? It's every time you come to Orlando, you randomly run into us. I know, it's such a small town, but one, <laughs> two, three! three. Anyways, I haven't got to see my friends in a long time. It's really nice to see them in person. This is this year's Mickey and Minnie Christmas plushes. Minnie and Mickey. Oh, they're so cute. All right, I'm about to get this hat. I love this. Okay, I found a lot more of the Christmas section back here. Well, Ryan found it and pointed it out. Oh, they do have a lot of Christmas stuff. Oh my gosh, look at this tumbler. <gasps> That is so fun. These are cute. Is it Mickey and Minnie or just two snowmen? This one doesn't have an eyeball. Winky. Oh my gosh. Oh, I thought it's I got Winky. like slashed out. <laughs> That'd be I think scary. it's too Mickey. Look at that Mickey sweater. This is so cute. What? I love that. All right, guys, I'm back in my room now. I got a, a Gideon's cookie, the November cookie with Lassie and Ryan here. I'll show you guys real quick. Here it is right here. It is the pumpkin crumble, I believe, the special one for November. I'm gonna save that and eat that later. Um, I also got my running stuff, my bib pin, my shirt for tomorrow, my shorts, my shoes, my socks, everything ready for the morning. It is um, just past seven o'clock. I'm up a little bit later than I should be, honestly, but I really um, wanted to get a cookie and hang out with Lassie and Ryan for a little while, but I'm gonna take a shower, lay down, and snooze off because I already don't have eight hours of sleep as it is because I have to get up at 2.30 tomorrow for my 5K, and I'm so excited, but yeah, I definitely need some sleep. So, hope you guys enjoyed my um, travel day today. Thank you guys for coming along with me, and um, yeah, I gotta get to sleep, so good night.